So lately I've been creating more videos on Instagram and TikTok, almost daily. This also means that my files grow bigger each day. And my storage couldn't keep up. I used to think that having multiple hard drives was enough, until I realized how much time I was wasting just figuring out where things were. And then my worst fear happened. Two of my hard drives suddenly stopped working. My old client projects and some of my travel memories are basically gone. That's when I started looking for something reliable, something that could store my projects in one place, safely and make my workflow smoother. After a few days of research and a lot of comparison videos later, I think I finally found what I was looking for, a NAS setup that actually makes sense for a solo creator like me. It's not just about having more storage, it's about keeping everything backed up and being able to access your files anytime you need them. So in this video, I want to share why I decided to set up my own NAS, what I'm using, and how it's been changing the way I handle all my video projects. If you're a creator, you probably experienced this. Piles of hard drives everywhere, a bunch of folders that doesn't make sense, and that low-key fear that you might erase something that is important. I used to think that data management doesn't really matter, especially if you're creative. But as my projects got bigger, so did the chaos. Losing just one drive can mean losing months of footage. And spending hours just looking for one clip kills creative momentum. So for me, getting organized isn't just about neatness anymore. It's about protecting my work and making sure my creative flow stays uninterrupted. The Ugreen NAS Sync DH4300 Plus is basically your own personal cloud. But instead of paying monthly fees, all your data stays local, safe inside the drives you own. It works just like cloud storage. You can share, backup, and access your files anywhere. But you're not renting your space from someone else. This Ugreen NAS can hold up to maximum of 120 terabytes of storage. That's around 41 million photos, 80,000 movies, or 125 million files. So yeah, that's a lot of storage. And it's compatible with wide list of HDD brands. So if you already have drives lying around, probably you can reuse them. I'll leave the full compatibility list linked below so you can check yours. What surprised me the most is how easy it is to set up. You literally just slide the drives in. When you turn it on for the first time, it walks you through a quick setup guide, step by step. Even if you've never used a NAS before, you'll get it up and running in just minutes. Once it's set, you can access everything on your computer or on your phone. It is compatible with Windows, Mac OS, Android, or iPhone. It all connects seamlessly through the Ugreen app. The Ugreen NAS comes with 2.5 gigabit of Ethernet, which means file transfers are fast, like transferring 1 gig of video file in just a few seconds, that kind of fast. When I compared it to uploading to cloud storage, and it wasn't even close, and that's a game changer in my workflow, especially when moving large project files or backups. This one's actually really cool, the AI album assistant. It automatically organizes your photos. It recognizes people and places, so your photos sort themselves without you lifting a finger. It also can spot duplicate photos and similar shots so you can easily just save the best ones. No more endless scrolling just to find that one photo from a trip. If you work with a team or just sharing it with your family, you can create multiple accounts with custom permissions. So everyone only see what they need to. It also supports NFC login so you can tap to access your account instantly. No typing passwords every time. You can access your NAS too much in anything, your computer, your phone, or even on your TV. Edit videos on your PC, browse your photos on your phone, or stream your movies on your TV. Everything stays synced on the app. And yes, you can still access your files remotely when you're away from home. Here's exactly how I integrated this NAS to my workflow. So firstly, I copy my footage to a fast SSD. 
for active editing in DaVinci Resolve. And then I organize it. My folder structure stays the same because I'm using a bash script like this. And then once the project is done, I exported everything to the NAS. The NAS becomes the final home base for everything. Projects, raw footage, and exports. All neatly structured and backed up. It honestly made my whole process feel smoother. I don't waste time looking for files or worrying about losing anything. One of my favorite parts is that knowing my data is actually mine. The Ugreen Security Manager handles real-time virus scanning and flexible permission management. So you can keep sensitive projects safe. And because everything's stored locally, nothing leaves your drives without your permission. After switching to Ugreen NAS, no more guessing which drives holds what. No more paying monthly for cloud storage that I barely use. I can access my files anywhere, even when traveling. My workflow finally feels calm and organized. So here's my final thought. If you're juggling between drives or paying monthly for your cloud services, this might be the best middle ground. Private, expandable, and genuinely fast. For me, it's not just about the storage, it's the peace of mind. Knowing that everything I've made from old projects to new edits lives safely in one place. Anyway, that's how I've been using this NAS in my setup. And if you want to check it out, I have the links in the description. And hopefully this video helped you if you're in the fans of getting a NAS system. And that is it. Thanks for watching. I'm Alvin and I'll see you again next time. Bye.